guys, welcome back to another play session of Guild Wars 2, Season 1 of Living World. Yeah, as you can see, I changed up Miss Jessica's outfit. Found a cute little kitty hoodie for her. So, well, when I logged in, there was an event going on. The Adventures event. I've played a little bit of this already with her, and boy, does this bring back memories. Good old 8 bit games. Love it. This is where I conduct my business. Um, you are in violation of city regulations. So, my counselor will hear about We are going to explore that for a bit. And also, what I did offline was I went around exploring, getting more uh, uh, hero points. Um, so we can start leveling her skills up right now. Bring this in front. I've been delving into eternal alchemy. Theory. That is what I'm set up with because this is helping out my uh, arrow. How to account for the variables. This no intellectual interest in anything beyond your current project. Actually, this is what I'm set up for. Let the College of Statics find uses for my work. This is what we're going for, and this is the uh, Soul Beast tree. Um, as you can see, I got that one. We still need a few more for that. Get that. But I am sticking with this one for now um, until we get a Soul Tree, Soul Beast tree filled out. Um, and see down here, we are working on that third one. So that's 10 master points, but I am trying to go through this and get this clocked out. See how much more advantageous this is going to be for her. So with all that being said, guys, you see now what's going on with Miss Jessica and Pooh Bear. We are going to explore this adventure. So let's oh, yeah. And I did pick up some uh, packages from it. Um, we do have a Super B mail carrier. Um, we have a Super Box of Fun. And... Supposed to have... Oh, yep. Yeah. Infinite Continue Coin. For it. You'll see what the Continue Coins are used for. Once you get that, you don't need the Continue Coins to give you, because they give you a few. So, But this is also one of the chairs you can get in the shop right now I think it's cool but anyways let's go in here and show you what's up now there are some achievements you can get in this I was reading them up because um, I've never done this so this is pretty cool as you can see it's bringing back for me old nostalgia 8-bit gaming time where these were the games this is what we played on uh, 600 by 800. That was it. So. And they did use something similar to Mario Brothers, too. As you can tell, I'm getting this huge Mario Brothers kind of feel. Um, but there, oh, see, there's arrows. Little hand arrows. Um, up here. Tuck bubbles. That's the currency, by the way. If you didn't know. I don't know. Is that one? That is. Oh, wow. Got to get the clouds. Okay. Well, let's use some of this. Let's see what we can get. Uh, yeah, we're not getting up that way. Pointing down. 
but there's a flag right there too. And you see Tetris vibes, everything going on. Got all that right there. What? Oh, fireworks. So. Ah. Anyways, let's jump into the game. Um, each one of these houses equals a level. So, um, up to level two or three, I can't remember which one, but I'm at one of those levels. Um, hey, there's a cloud right there. Let's go after that cloud. I can get that cloud. We can get that cloud. We can get that cloud. The gliding disabled. Oh no. Yeah, your gliding's disabled. Wow. Well, anyways. Uh, let's go back to level one and we'll start with level one. Um, level one contains five zones. Level two contains about five zones. So, uh... okay, these are the different modes you can play in. Um, let's just go straight for our hardcore game. Zone one. And you get queued up for it. So, you can play this solo. There are dailies for this. So, yeah, this brings back ghouls and goblins. Goblins and ghosts. That is health. So don't grab that. Uh, there is a chest. There are two chests in this level. From what I saw in the achievement guide. And there we go. You want to collect those. Trust me, you'll find out get a really decent weapon. There's supposedly a beehive in here, too. So, and you can do a race. There is a race thing right there. He is the race dude. Um, it'll light up with coins. You gotta go do the coins. We're not gonna do that. Well, I'll go after these. You are granted the stick. Collect as much of the bobbles as you can. See, since we have health, we can't get that of that. So, follow your little arrows if they're there. Oh, is there another one? Huh. There we go. Step for those stupid monkeys. Get those. Ah! I fell. Gotta kill the snake. Now, I am looking for that other chest. If I can find that other chest, we can complete this pretty good. I'm not seeing that chest. Oh, I think I see the chest. Alrighty. Monkey. Now we gotta go all the way back to the beginning on this one. 
Um, and get up there and go up top, to top. Something tells me we need to stay on the top part of this. So. Let's go to the top part. Yes, it is a bit of a jumping puzzle. I don't mind it. It's, it's, it's actually quite fun. I mean, who knows? All these videos this week could be just us exploring this. Which, as you can tell, I don't mind. Ah! So, it is a fun little festive thing they got going. I will admit that. Um, it's great to take breaks in the game. Adventuring and doing the story quest because, well, you know... You need to take a break in life, too, so... Ah! Down to one heart. Got the fire. I wonder where is this chest? There it is. There's a big chest. We want that chest. And then we got all the chests in this level. No! Where's the key? Key. Can you give me the key? Oh crap, we gotta go find this key. Ah! We gotta find this key, guys. We're not leaving the zone until we get this key. Ah, uh, got some help. As you can see, your health meter are the hearts. So, you can buy health potions. I have actually got a few that stays with me. Um, what's in here? What's Sarlo? He's got a shovel. He's got a key, too. What is this? This one, extra life. Nah. What is this? Yes, we're going to buy the shovel. Um, yes, we are going to buy that key. And... Oh, we have to use that key. Go use that key on that chest. We know where the chest is at. There's the chest. 20. Now there is a, a an achievement for breaking stuff inside the house, breaking furniture. So we are in here. He's mad. I said there is an achievement for this. So we gotta go into all these houses and break all these furniture. And you know what? I think I saw a place where we can use our bombs because I did do have a set of bombs right there. There we go. Um, yeah, right here. That's a place where we can set bombs. Something tells me something good's in there.
Aha! Finding secrets now. Ooh. This is a good secret. See, once you get ahead, you get certain things, and it helps you out. So, we gotta make up for that one. In fact, what's our baubles looking like? Which is the currency in this? Um... 175 plus 54, okay, because there's a weapon on here I want to get a hold of, which will help out a lot later on in the levels. So, we'll get on that. Let's go ahead and bounce over. This, you just die. I think this part was just straightforward. Um, we have got to look for this beehive because I think the beehive is over here somewhere. They're opening flowers, which is great. I think we gotta follow these to find out where the beehive is at. for me. I'm sorry. Follow the bees. That's all I'm doing. There it is. There's Queen Bee. There's Queen Bee. This. We'll get this. It does take some of our baubles, but that's fine. Yes, we got it. Killed the queen bee. That is an actual achievement in here. So just follow the bees. Now we can go around and kill everything else to make up for it. Um... So... Like I said, that is an actual achievement in the game. I'm glad we were able to do that. I have not done that, like I said. I did just quick views around, quick walkthroughs around. That was about it. Um, now we need to figure out where to go. If you see anything that looks exploding, let me know. There's the end. 
And we're up here. Um, there was nothing that looked exploding, so... Go to the second place. Good moving. Ah, there's a house. Head into the house. Remember, we gotta destroy stuff. He's got the whip. That's what we want. We want that whip. Oh, <laughs> 